Welcome to Atharashi Hinode by D3 Solutions. I have uploaded one video about exterior angle property of a triangle. And this video is about angles of property. This is a property connecting the three angles of a triangle. Today we are going to see this through two methods. Before that, let us have a glimpse on angles. This is a right angle. We know its angle measure is 90 degree. If the angle measure is less than 90 degree, it is an acute angle. And if it is greater than 90 degree, it is an obtuse angle. Now, what about this angle? It is a straight angle and its angle measure is 180 degree. Now let us go to the first method. Here you can see one triangle. Let me cut this triangle on the three angles like this. Next I am going to rearrange these pieces. Here you can see all the three angles of this triangle. And these three angles now constitute one angle. That is a straight angle and has a measure 180 degree. So, in this triangle ABC, we get measure of angle A plus measure of angle B plus measure of angle C equal to 180 degree. That is, the sum of the measures of the three angles of a triangle is 180 degree. Let us go to the second method. Here also I have taken one triangle. In the first method, I have taken one triangle and cut out the three angles and rearranged like this. But here, I am taking two more copies of this triangle. Keep the first triangle as it is. Move the second triangle very close to the first triangle like this and the third also. Here all the three angles are angles of the same triangle only. And you can see these three angles now constitute one angle. That is a straight angle. So, its measure is 180 degree. Here also we get the sum of the measures of the three angles of a triangle is 180 degree. That is, here we have observed the same fact in two different ways. That is the angle sub property of a triangle. And if we take a closer look at this, here you can see this is an exterior angle for this triangle. And what about the angle measure of this exterior angle? It is nothing but the sum of the measures of angle 1 and angle 2. And what about these angles 1 and 2? They are the interior opposite angles. So here we get measure of the exterior angle equal to sum of the measures of the interior opposite angles. And if we take this triangle, here also we can see the same. That is, measure of this exterior angle is equal to sum of the measures of these two interior opposite angles. That means here we can also see 
the exterior angle property. So, these are the two properties of a triangle based on its angles. Hope it is clear to you. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching.